I was making tackles all over the place. John Madden is screaming at uh, Jim Otto, come on, get to him for crying out loud. I looked up at Madden and I said, coach, he's not fast enough. The following year, we're playing out in Oakland. He hits me, undresses me, and I am absolutely out cold. And John Madden looks down at me and he says, well, Bergie, is he fast enough now? And I go, uh-huh. Double zeros, when you see double zeros, uh, it's not good at all. You want to stay away as far as you can from the double zero man. This guy was awesome, a demon with a killer's instinct. Jim Otto had what I call the six inch punch. Just before uh, impact, he would be able to, to coil his body and, and really rip into you. Now, a, a middle linebacker, defensive players, we don't feel ouch, ooh, hurt, and pain. But let me tell you what, when Jim Otto hits you, guess what? It hurts. I've never been afraid of anything. I could play against King Kong, I think, and uh, we'd have a battle. You know, I think the face mask was probably bent a little bit. He had kind of like a little hook in his nose. My nose would be broken all year long. It would just get broken each game. I get pushed on one side of my face, then on the other side of my face. He ran kind of funny. He had a little bit of a pot gut. My number, double zero, uh, came from a nickname, and it was Ott. And Mr. AFL 00 Jim Otto, the nine-year All-Pro center. They called me Buckethead because I had a, a helmet size eight and an eighth. I had a very large head. And uh, then I was one of the older guys on the team, and they called me Pops. Jim Otto was an original Raider at the center of it all. From 19 straight losses in the early 60s to Oakland's last-minute win in the Heidi Bowl. He was there for the Raiders' first ever Super Bowl. In 1972, he even caught a pass in a playoff game in Pittsburgh, although everyone remembers the game for another reception. In his second to last game, he snapped the ball for the famous Sea of Hands catch, the Raiders' most dramatic playoff win ever. By the time he was done, he had played in 308 straight games, the most in Raider history. I've had 39 surgeries. I've had 28 knee surgeries. Both knees are artificial. I've had eight artificial knees. We loved to play football. We beat the hell out of each other and had a great time doing it. At that particular time, I thought maybe I shouldn't have done it, but as soon as you uh, heal up a little bit, you think, gosh, I'd do it again. 